Welcome back to Skyrim. I'm Crix. Let's get into it. Alright. Alright, let's see. Alduin's Wall. Man, I forgot to even get my armor from her. Alright, you know what? We're gonna take a little break from the main quest. We're gonna go to the Thieves Guild stuff. Anything in my inventory that I need to disenchant or anything? Ooh, I need to take uh, all these books back to uh, Whiterun. Can I pass trouble? That was weird. <laughs> to get another level. <clears throat> Let's check that real quick. Oh, we, we already got it. Okay. That's interesting. Okay, that's the one I'm after there. With that one. Hmm. Why not? Well, I don't know. I want to wait and see what we have first. Um, let's see. Definitely need sneak. And lock picking. Go ahead and get into lock picking and sneak. Um, oh, I already got pickpocking. Okay. That tripwire. Hmm. 
Why not? I think it said there's a power. Yeah. Don't think we're in too ne too much need of uh, uh, gold, but sure, I'll give it a shot. <clears throat> this ought to be interesting. Where'd he go? Got the shield out. If you were getting them from my farm, I guess it already counted. Yep. Oh well. Alright, I'm not gonna stand around and wait for somebody to trip over it. Ah, oh, man! <laughs> we'll try that again later. <laughs> I figure as soon as I snap it, though, somebody come walking up. problem with this thing. Just looks like you could fit more on there. Hmm. Oh well.
Alright. Later, Lydia. <laughs> Alright. Where are we heading? Heading back to Riften. So now I gotta go talk to what was her name? Like Talia or something like that. To get my Thieves Guild suit. I gotta talk to Vex and What was it you saying? Before we begin, I wanna make two things perfectly clear. One, I'm the best infiltrator this rat hole of a guild's got. So if you think you're here to replace me, you're dead wrong. No. And two, you follow my lead and do exactly as I say. No questions, no excuses. We'll see. Easy, huh? So, should I just hand you purses of coin or are you gonna work to earn your keep? Let me give you a small <laughs> bit of advice. Nothing in this line of work is easy. If it was, every drag in the rat way would be robbing Rift and Blind. If something's being handed to you on a silver platter, then there's a catch. Steal the platter instead. You get it? Mm -hmm. Then we understand each other. Good. Now, it's time to get your feet wet. And I don't want to waste a lot of time talking about anything but business. I'm not going to sugarcoat it for you. We're in a bad way down here. Who knows? Old Delvin thinks it's some kind of curse. I think he's crazy. If you want my opinion, I'd say it's just plain old bad luck. You can get out there and start making a name for us again. Make them start fearing us like they did long ago. And while you're at it, make a little bit of coin on the side. Sounds okay. good to me. All right. It's been a while since I've seen one of those. What you've got there is a stone of Baron Zaya. Not like that, it isn't. The stone was pried off of Baron Zaya's ceremonial crown by a thief in order to cover his tracks. I think there were 24 in all. Most people keep them as a curiosity. Some of the guild members have tried to locate them over the years, but they haven't been successful. Well, until now. Look, I only buy things I can turn around quickly for a profit. And no one wants these stones unless they have the whole set. Tell you what, if you find the rest of them, talk to me again. Otherwise, keep it. Maybe it'll bring you luck. Alright, so I've got a mod that is specifically for that. It tracks those and makes it easier for them to find, be able to find them. <laughs> yeah, I did. That wood elf's wit. He's a lot smarter than I expected. Can you believe that Fetcher had more than tripled the guard? There must have been eight of them in there. It was like he was daring us to come and get him. Well, there's an old sewer tunnel that dumps into the lake on the northwest side of the island. That's how I slipped in there. Should still be unguarded. If you're ever in need of some quick coin for items you find on the job, Tenelia is the best fence around. And besides myself, Delvin, Niruin, and Vipper can help you with any sort of training you might need to sharpen your skills. Are you kidding me? Ever since the guild's luck turned sour, we haven't had a coin to our name. 
And when the coin dried up, that's when people started to leave. We had the best of everything down here. The Ratway was a damn palace. The only way this place will ever return to its glory days is if we can finish these extra jobs and start the gold flowing again. The Flagon was once a city beneath the city. We had our own smith, our own alchemist, you name it. If we can make a name for ourselves in Skyrim once again, I can almost promise you those merchants would return. Best of all, we'd have enough gold to throw around so we could start living in the lap of luxury again. <laughs> all right, but if you get arrested, don't blame it on me. <laughs> I handle the burglary, shell, sweep, and heist jobs. Most of them involve breaking and entering. If you don't like that kind of work, talk to Delvin. He runs the more up close and personal jobs. Pretty simple. Break into a house, grab a specific item, and get out before they realize what's going on. The catch is you can't kill anyone who lives there, or you forfeit the payment. You ready for some good old fashioned burglary? Fine. Here's everything you need to know. So you're the new recruit, huh? Well, looks like you and I are gonna have to get very well acquainted. Of course. You're the fence. I'm the fence down here. You come by anything you don't exactly own, and I'll pay you some coin for it. Minus a little space <coughs> for the guild, of course. I can also provide a few supplies useful to our trade now and again. For a small fee. Sure. How about I get Dirge to knock you over your head and dump you into the cistern? <laughs> Look, I've been in this business a long time, and I've seen all types. You can play it tough, or you can play it smart. Whatever. At the end of the day, you'll find that all we care about down here is how much gold you can make us. Good. Then there isn't much more to say. Here's your armor. Just make sure you put it to good use. I've got coin and I've got merchandise. Let's see what we can do. What do you got? See, do I have anything else that's stolen? He just plucked you off the street and dropped you into the thick of things without telling you which way is up. Am I right? Lying to my face isn't going to win you any favors with me. <laughs> I can promise you that. On the other hand, taking some of these extra jobs off my hands, now, that'll get you to the top of my list. See, that kind of attitude comes from someone who wants to get rich and stay alive long enough to enjoy it. We're gonna get along nicely. So, if you've got the nerve, I've got plenty of extra jobs to help get the guild back on its feet. Look around you. The flagon, the guild, it's all falling apart. A few decades ago, this place was as busy as the Imperial City. Now, 
You'd be lucky if you don't trip over a skeever instead. Look, I know the others think I'm a bit dull for saying stuff like this, but I'm gonna give it you straight. Something out there is pissed drunk mad at us. I don't know who or what it is, but it's beyond just you and me. We've been cursed. I'll tell you what we do. We spit in that curse's face and turn things around down here. Put things back the way they were. That's where you come in. I've got plenty of work available that could guide us down the road to recovery. All you need to do is ask, and we can both come out of this smelling like a rose. <laughs> Stick with me, and they'll never even know you're there. Oh, turning Max out. I had all the fishing, numbers, and bedlam jobs. The ones with a more personal touch. If breakings are more your thing, go talk to Vex. Most of the establishments in Skyrim keep their transactions recorded within business ledgers. Your job will be to change the numbers in those books so the shortfalls from our other jobs look legit. Feel like doing a bit of writing. Finally, someone with backbone. Here you go. <laughs> Something troubling you? Watch yourself out there. The mercenaries are in Goth Hire to train killers. Just ask our poor little Vex. Don't forget you're representing the guild. Don't do anything stupid. Pickpocketing on boots. Go ahead and take care of that optional thing. Oh, you're back. Well, you done or what? <laughs> yeah, can you believe that? I already did like this, but... Daring us to... Well, that's how I slipped in there. Should still be unguarded. Okay, thanks. First, gonna go take care of the Golden Glow Estates. Then, we'll take care of these other two jobs. I know after you do so many of each of them, from each uh, one, I mean, so many from Vex and so many from Delvin, you get a special one. You'll get a special one from, uh, um, Bring you off. Alright. So gotta head. Was that west? I think. Alright. I need. I also need to talk to this guy. But. I can do that another time. But for now. I'm just gonna use his. Uh, no. I don't wanna upgrade it. Um, equipment. That'd give me a good profit. Oh, I ran out of uh, 
ingots. <laughs> Jeez. I'm running out. I'm running out of leather. Be close. It's so good to see you again. Thank you. Divines bless your kind heart. Mm -hmm. Save me some time and just court out there. See, I need to head west. Uh, yeah, I'll go ahead and take the horse. I'm just going to keep moving. I didn't kill these guys. Something else did.
Okay. Interesting. I think I'm wearing light armor. I didn't see that one up there. Hmm. Go with our tree. since I've done this but in any case it's gonna be fun All right. I've got to destroy the bee house or burn them these arrows do chaos damage which includes burn so I'm wondering if I just might be able to shoot them uh oh. 
My oh, crap. Y'all can keep looking for me all you want to. You ain't got nothing I want, dude. Alright. <clears throat> what was that? It's gonna work. Nice. Draw their attention over there. And get it off of the main place up here. Ah, he moved.
Who's there? Nobody. Didn't want my ears here. Yeah, there it is. I think there's two guys over here. Ooh! Ah, oh, dude, he moved. Oh, man. Give my arrow back. <laughs> I already got the key. I don't need it. But I'll take it anyway.
Okay. What am I stuck on? Oh, um, well. <laughs> Dude, you killed a chicken. Things I do for a damn screenshot. Ah, oh, come on. I ain't got time for this shit. I doubt it'll let me, but let's try it. No, oh, okay. I'm far enough away from everybody. His golden glow has been hit. Good job, Laugh. 
Let me take a look at what you found. Arengoth sold Golden Glow? What's that idiot thinking? He has no idea the extent of Maven's fury when she's been cut out of a deal. But I'm certain he'll find out. If only the parchment had the buyer's name instead of this odd symbol. Any idea what that might be? Blast. Well, I'll check my sources and speak to Mercer. But for now, you're off to speak to Maven Blackbriar. She asked for you by name. No hell. Uh, no. Nothing like that. You're calling on her for business. That's between you and Maven. And I prefer to keep it that way. Don't worry about it. Maven's business dealings usually involve quite a bit of gold for her people. <laughs> of course, your pay. <laughs> You're smart as a whiplash. <laughs> Keep doing right by us, and there's plenty more where that came from. Until next, we meet live. So I gotta talk to Maven. Really? You're gonna close right as I come out. Ah. Damn fence. Alright. Catch her while she's outside. So you're the one. Hmm. You don't look so impressive. You're a firebrand, aren't you? It's about time Brynjolf sent me someone with business sense. I was beginning to think he was running some sort of beggar's guild over there. Faith. I don't have faith in anyone. All I care about is cause and effect. Did the job get done and was it done correctly? There's no gray area. I hope not. This is an important job. I have a competitor called Hunning Brumidery that I want to put out of business. I also want to know how they managed to get the place up and running so quickly. Head to the Bannered Mare in Whiterun and look for Malus Machius. He'll fill you in on all the details. One more time in case I wasn't clear. You butcher this job and you will be sorry. Yeah, whatever. Alright, uh... Da, da, da. All right. I'm going to go ahead and call the episode here. Thank y'all for joining me. If you liked the video, hit the like button. If you want to see more, hit subscribe. Don't forget to hit that bell. Y'all comment and share if you like. I'm Crix. Y'all take it easy. Later.